Hello, hello, testing. Hello. Awesome. It's working. <clears throat> Where is everybody? Oh, I started five minutes early. I got permission from my wife to do so. Moody Blues is number one. Hello. Uh, Kiefer Kirby, number two. Uh, Trollkey I8, number three. Riley Finchfield Hello is number four. Bloody Goop is number five. Glitching Vortex, number six. Michael Clark, number seven. Hazy Hills, yo, number eight. Tiara Spark at number nine. You made the top ten, Tiara Spark. All right. Such much love to bloody old England and much love to New England. I love you both. If it wasn't for the England, we wouldn't speak English. We'd be speaking either Japanese or German because of World War II. How long the stream? Uh, till four o'clock. Four o'clock. Trollkey, how are you? Are you new, Trollkey? Bumbutt. Hello, Bumbutt. I'm new. Please, if you're new, please hit my subscribe button so it'll show up on the screen. You'll be able to see it with the little uh, apocalypse guy. Imperial metric system. I don't know. Come on, uh, Bumbutt. Push my uh, subscribe button. So it's 4,239. Ah, you, you took it off. That's not good. How many hours? Uh, in three minutes will be two hours. Live stream. Thank you. One more, one more time. Come on, you can do it. Juxtapose changes icon to caution. What's up with that? I wish we used... The metric system. Okay, there you go. I just subscribed. Okay, it should come on. It should come up there. Where's the Martian? I gotta turn this on so I can hear myself. Hit that like button too, guys. Just checking the system, see if it's all good. Oh, troll key sub from the L.A. Beast uh, raid. Thank you. <coughs> Stephen Greer, hello. Ha ha. It's a radioactive symbol for the new Chernobyl show that came out yesterday. Ah, gotcha. DJ Southpaw, hello. I'm not paneling. So, how do people become mod-like? Ah. Here's the rules. I'm going to show you the rules. Glad you asked. Uh-oh. There it is. Nightbot's working. All right. It's the last time I checked this for whenever it glitches again. What's... Michael Clark wants to know what's the aim of the stream today. Uh, checking the systems. That's all it is. I'm checking the system. See if it's work. I say I seen the trailer for that and clicked on a how to survive a nuke. Uh oh. You know Utah has all the nukes in the world. Utah's gonna nuke the whole world. Judge supposed tells me not to warn people about that. You pray someone doesn't make you won because it's a payless and thankless job. Exactly, juxtaposed. Well, I, I've given, I've donated money to you, so. <laughs> I should give you a monthly check, though. <laughs> you got any favorite movie? Oh, my favorite movie, No Gal Watson. My favorite movie of all time is Top Gun. And my favorite country is England. Over the USA. Because England rocks. They gave us the English language. And we need we need to get Queen Elizabeth over here and be the queen here. Nuclear 
Googleology. Thank you. Ali Sensi's here. Sunday. I meet Ali Sensi this Sunday, guys. I already met her partner, Eva. So I'll meet her again a second time. Looking forward to that. Are we supposed to keep that secret, Ali, or is, or, is, or is the cat out of the bag? Can you guys hear me okay? You could say England is my city. Yeah. England is my city, country, and state. How's your day? My day is going great, man. My wife let me go early. And I'm here till 4 o'clock, two more hours. It's fine to talk about it. Ha ha, yeah. Because you, Ali Sensi gets, check out Ali Sensi's, uh, I mean, don't just check it out, but ring her bell on her channel. Chernobyl was four times worse than Hiroshima. Really? Wow. Queen Elizabeth lies. Going to end up retiring in the next few years. Michael Clark, are you in England? Oh, West Haven, always and forever. Thank you for the $2 donation. Karen Bates Scammers, hello. How are you? Good to see you. Thank you, West Haven. That goes for my Thanks camera. Thank you, donation. Oh, there it is. It's working. Yes. And let's see the munchkin go around. Or doesn't the munchkin go around? There it is. The apocalypse zombie. Woohoo! Yeah. Thank you. Queen won't abdicate. She will ride it to death. 92 now or submit. She is a cocker. Nobody in England likes Queen Elizabeth. We need the queen to come here and stay here forever. Nobody in England likes her. Get over here, queen. <laughs> I can hardly wait till you get a king, man. I've never seen a king of England. Never in my whole life. I was born in 1952, so you know my age now. I added her as a friend on Facebook or Twitter. Can't remember which. Who you added? Stephen Greer, you added uh, Queen Elizabeth. Nobody in England likes her. Roasted studio, not very clear yet what happened and all the shooters are caught yet. Where? Where's the shootings at? How did he get away with saying that without Nightbot? Moody Blues, I would love to go on that tour. What tour? Oh my, just terrible. We hear about things like that. Where is this, in England? Did they have a shooter in England? Queen Elizabeth is a marshmallow puff. Moody Blues lives in Canada. Queen Elizabeth don't say shh crap. Oh my. Oh my, oh my. Um, I have a new uh, so subscriber. He subscribed a couple of days ago. And that, yeah, or actually yes, was it yes, yesterday. Uh, hello, Drew's Food Reviews. Hey, guess what, Michael? I got monetized over the weekend. Congratulations! Got monetized on Cinco de Mayo. Congratulations, Drew. Help him out, guys. Check out Drew's Food Reviews. What's Colorado? Oh, Colorado out of shooting? When was this? Yep, Canada. See, Moody Blues can't even stand Queen Elizabeth. And he's his... Queen! They offered tours of the Chernobyl power plant and Pryat, the city it wiped out. Wow. Congratulations, Drew's Food Reviews. Oh, my new subscriber's name is Casey. And if he's watching or listening, please come to the chat. Live chat. Diet Mountain Dew. I got a Diet 7-Up in the fridge and my wife ordered it. So it's hers, but I'm going to drink some. I told her that. I think it was Twitter because instead of fighting with people I do not know, I fight with my alter ego, Gator. Moody Blues is pretty safe. The tour guides keep you out of the really bad areas and give you 
Oh, yikes. I'm not traveling there anytime soon. <clears throat> Just you meet you man. People who were kids went back to see their old homes and ruin fortunate still there and everything spooky. So all we have to do is bomb those towers. What's what's the weather? <clears throat> Ah, uh, man. Like social, local weather, not social. 75 degrees. <laughs> getting ready, man. Get my ADD and I'm getting ready to go out to uh, the National Guard. <clears throat> Move. Salem, Mike is a witch. That's Salem, Massachusetts, Trollkey. And I'm not there. I'm in Salem, Oregon. Salem, Snorigan. I'm snoring. Stephen Greer says I'm hilarious. Thank you, Stephen Greer. I hope that's what he meant. If he meant something else, I don't know. Blue D moves. Oh, he's laughing at that. Got it. I still like Moody Blues. I'm glad he changed to Moody Blues. I love that band. A Nerf Salmon concert. Love to do it. <clears throat> so at 4 o'clock, I'm signing off. It's 75 there. It's audit time. You got it. Unless it starts raining, which I've seen it rain up until July. They should have Diet Mountain Dews of all the flavors. Even the uh, Giant Dad, bro. My Nights in White Satin. That's my favorite song of all time by the Moody Blues. Nights in White Satin. Ride, ride my seesaw. I like that one too. That's not the name of it, but I just thought of it. She skates, 926. We cannot cuss in here. You're only 10 years old, for God's sake. When are you going to be 11? She skateboards, guys. I'll never go on a skateboard ever again. I'm meeting Ali Sepsi this coming Sunday. Woohoo! We're going to do up the to town here. <laughs> Hopefully, we can go live. Nine twenty six. What I say? Nine twenty eight. Sorry, Jason Chains. Chain, chain, chain. Good afternoon, fellas. I got a new puppy. Yay! Cool. What kind of puppy did you get? Nights and White Setting is based on a classical composition. Bell Belvis, you in England too? That's where they come from, right? England. My birthday is nine twenty six. Oh, okay. You're older than Eric by uh, less than a month. His is November 13th. Do you know the George Send a Channel? Nope. Peyton Cannon. Never heard of him. Great song. Oh, I, I love that song. They're from England, I do believe. Half Mastiff, half Pitbull. Oh, be careful with that new puppy. Too damn hot. What's too damn hot? It's hot where you're at. It's going to be 81 when we're there Sunday. Oh, we'll be in air conditioning places. You know, uh, we got to go to uh, um, um, Walmart to pick up flowers for my wife. I'm paying for all this, too. And we got to go to uh, Denny's to eat. I'm from the Netherlands. Oh, Netherlands. Oh, that's right. You are Netherlands. Niederhosen. Niederhosen. Can see her on my Instagram. Same name as here. Cool. Look him up. He's a weird YouTuber. So am I. I'm very strange. 
Five subs still going to be torn. Yes. Five subs will still be even if it has stretched to six subs. Our great Dane was... So tell everybody about my channel. I talked to Eve about the Walmart and she's cool with it. Awesome. And cool with the Wendy's too. I mean, Wendy's. I always say Wendy's and I think of D Denny's. All That's why they sound similar. Wendy's and Denny's. Denny's. She's cool with Denny's too, right? Is she cool with the live stream or no? If she's not, then we won't live stream. I like nights in white satin, never reaching the end. Letters I've written, never meaning to send. Beauty I've always missed with these eyes before. Okay. Netherlands. We had a legendary band playing prog rock named Trace. Or Tracy. Mike, don't forget your EFPTS card. Oh, yeah. I got to pick that up. Knights and White Sun is probably the only song most people know by them. Uh, ride, ride my seesaw. Da, 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 da. Oh, you're hot. He's off the deep end. Wow. Just what the truth is, I can't say anymore. Because I love you. I think they're from England, right? Yes, I. Hello from Wisconsin. I'm hungry. Go get some che Wisconsin cheese drunk drawer. Is there really 75 here? Hey Siri, what's the temperature in Salem, Oregon right now? It's about 75 degrees outside. Ah, juxtaposed with right on. Nightbot works. See y'all later. Take care, she skates 926. Be careful on those uh, skateboards and enjoy your new puppy dog. Hope it never bites you or bites anybody. Here's this channel. Okay. What does he do? Alright, this is oh. one of the Oh, yeah, I don't want to mirror yeah. you. Yeah, yeah. I can't mirror the guy. He'll get pissed off. Did you guys hear all that crap? Damn. Yeah, Moody Blues is a British band. Right on. Tuesday afternoon, the trees are calling me near. Got to find out why the little voices I hear explain it all with the song. Tuesday. Oh, it is Tuesday afternoon, by the way. And almost Tuesday evening on the East Coast. And it's Tuesday evening. In England, where the Muti Blues live. He has a girlfriend who he claims he never hits. Who does? Oh, the guy that you sent the link to. Wow. Tuesday afternoon. Yeah, I love the Muti Blues. Have their CD greatest hits or something like that. I don't know. Why do you think I sang it? I don't know. Because you like them? I like them. It's evening here on the East Coast. You're not near Washington, D.C. You're not hop, skipping a jump away from Washington, D.C. He's your age, I think. He's 66. Of course. Of course he's my age. Siri's age, too. I'll be 67 July 1st. On Canada Day, I'm in Baltimore. I knew it. You're not that far from Washington, D.C. You ever go to any Orioles games? Timothy Leary's dead. Oh, no. He's outside looking. Oh, that was one of their songs. And Timothy Leary was a tune-in dropout. Was it dropout, tune-in, or whatever? 
LSD guru. He was a Harvard grad, right? Sunshine State. That's either Florida or California. Yep, all the time. Have you been to Have you been to Washington D.C.? See, Washington D.C. is actually in the state of Maryland. People don't realize that it's not in any state, Malloy. Bullcrap, Florida. Gotcha, Florida, where the Chad still reign. <laughs> Who's going to get shot to death today at Westminster, Colorado? Wow. Good make music. Good make out music. Uh, watching from Newfoundland. Tyson is in Canada. Newfoundland. I've been to Florida, Georgia, and South Carolina. I've never been to any of those states. I can honestly say that. I want to go to London and Liverpool. And that's it. And where Tiara Spark lives. <laughs> where is Tiara Spark? A little bust move I like as well. You got it. 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 <laughs> I went. I want to go see the pyramids. Where is that, in Egypt? I don't want to go to Egypt. Ugh. I'm here just busy. Oh, I just wonder where you were on. Miss you. How have you been, Mike? I've been great. Our, our internet went out last night about 12 midnight, and I was ticked off. Couldn't even get television set. It hit the whole area of Salem. All it takes is a stealth bomber to, to uh, blow out all the uh, all the electric. Do you watch hockey? Uh, not really. I watch baseball. It's my sport. Then I like football. Then basketball. Whoosh! Boom! Yeah, all the electricity went out. You notice that was about what ten. 12, 15 years ago, I was in uh, Lake Los Angeles and all the electricity went out. And I heard it was the Air Force doing that. I bet you came from Area 51 orders. They could black out the whole United States if they wanted to. The Humpty Dance is your chance to hump. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Did you call a cable company and have them credit you the time down? Uh, no. My wife called them in the morning and they said that. And then it went up. Crap happens, yep. I remember and it was just outside of the Big East Coast blackout 2003. Oh, good morning to Alicia Joyce from Down Under. We're friends with Australia, England, Canada, New Zealand, New Guinea, all kinds of places. Sup, my guy? Carson Oren. How are you, Carson Oren? What's up? Not much is up. Uh... That one hit New York City. Alicia jo Joyce, long time no see. Alicia Joyce. I like that caution symbol juxtapose has. Because we're going to need it. What about Ukraine, Mike? That's under Russian rule. I, I worry about Ukraine. I'm not going to go there. Because Russians invaded it, man. I don't trust the Russian government, I can tell you that. Well, I don't trust this government, actually, either. I trust no government. Um, 220? 
I got till 4 p.m. today, and you guys can hear me okay. So that's good. Next time I'm on here will be uh, Thursday at 2 o'clock. I was five minutes early today. We don't like ours currently either. Provincial and federal. Tyson, where are you at again? Are you in Netherlands, you said, Tyson? Yes or no? I thought you said Netherlands. Netherlands. And nobody likes England government either. Yes, I was just outside of the grid that went down. Oh, Newfoundland. Oh, Canada. Oh, yeah, nobody likes... Nobody likes President Justin Trudeau. Nobody. Yet he's in office. But nobody likes Trump, and yet he's in office. Nobody likes President Theresa May, yet she's in office. I just trust all government. You know who I trust because you trust them as well. I don't trust any government. But I don't want total anarchy like my brother wants. My older brother wants. We elected Prime Minister Trudeau to get Harper out. Stephen Harper is a lot better than... You You got Harper care in, in Canada because of Har Stephen Harper. He was a great president. But Prime Minister... I mean, President Justin Trudeau is not good. His father was great. Pierre Trudeau was awesome. I think he was the best president because he spoke uh, French. The Holy Trinity. My, oh, yeah, I love the Holy Trinity. We have legal weed across Canada. Yes, you do. Every state in Canada, every provinces are e equal to states. So every province, every state in Canada has weed legal. Feds and uh, we can be more libertarian and have less government without it being total anarchy. There you go. I'm, you know, in 2020, I don't think I'll vote. I'm serious. I don't think I'll vote in 2020. Juan Carlos Provost Mako. I don't trust like that. Open that button. Harry from Harry's Car Place, 2014. So, so, not the best, Stephen. I'll get there. Yeah, you'll get to America and love it, Alicia Joyce. You'll want to stay in America. I'll sponsor you if I have to. Can we get F's in the chat for Tony Shark? Tony Stark? Samuel G. Who's Tony Stark? Laugh loud, no offense. What? 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 We have, oh, about the legal weed? She skates is only 10 years old. She's not here anymore, so we can talk about weed. I don't really want to, but we can. Yeah, and they also have animals that will eat your weed and carnivores. It's not legal in Australia or England. Canada's the only one. Iron Man. No above that, Mike, not weed. Oh, uh, what was it, Tyson? I forgot. Oh, that you don't like Trudeau. Nobody likes nobody likes President Trudeau. A prime minister is the same as a president. They do the same Hoover Dam things, and nobody likes them. F, yeah, F it. F F the governments. I might re-register to the Libertarian. My brother was one. Now he's a anarchist. No government. There's no government like no government. Hey, Canada has red, green, whatever that is. Red, green, and their flag. They have the they have the uh, England flag, almost. I think. Oh wait, it's the maple leaf, right? Oh, that's not England. England swings like a pendulum do. Bobby's riding bicycles two by two. Westminster Abbey, the town of Big Ben. The rosy red cheeks of the little children. I want Big Ben to come here in, in Oregon. 
That's what I want. I want big... We already got the London Bridge in Lake Havasu City, Arizona. And now I want Big Ben to show up in Salem, Oregon. Can we just steal Big Ben from you guys? I'm going to go... Bong! It sounds like a Catholic church. Bong! No comedian that uses duct tape to fix everything. I'm like, oh, don't know who that guy is. Big Ben is under construction. Rats. Why don't they just deport it to the Americas? That's we need. We need to be part of England for God's sake, because England's getting out of the European Union. Thank God. So is Canada. So are all the colony states. The Red Green Show. Never heard of it. Probably never will. It's, it's on TV, especially. I don't watch much TV. Uh, yeah, and Australia needs to be part of England too. I'm all for that. Alicia Joyce laughing at me. I'm from land down and up. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Minute work. Love them. Love England. I love England. I love you guys are the funniest chaps I've ever met. <laughs> chap. Chip, chip, cheerio, chap. We fought a war to get away from England, and we celebrate it every year. I don't think we want them still. Bring back England to America so we can have a king and queen, for God's sake. The Redcoats are coming. The Redcoats are coming. That's England. We love England. Less chaps. <laughs> Alicia Joyce's country fought off England too. So did Canada. Look what happened to them. They still have a king and queen. Or they still have a queen. The queen of England. Who sits on her duff. Doesn't do jack crap. Keel over. Queen keel over. Kick the bucket for God's sake. Uh oh. School shooting. Officials give update after... At least two people were in. See, a camera did not do the school shooting. Just to let you guys know. Hello, Turtle Man. Hello, one and all. I'm sad I could have gotten a girlfriend, but she decided to be friends with... Oh, Alicia Joyce, you turned Turtle down? I'm sorry you tur tur Turtle down. That sucks. At least, Turtle, Alicia's in Australia, for God's sake. How could she be your girlfriend? Just be your friend, dude. Don't don't be harping on Alicia Joyce. She's awesome. Or who can it be now? I love that. Ah, uh, Turtle is a friend. <laughs> See, I knew it. You're just friends, Alicia Joyce and Turtle, man. You're just friends. <laughs> Friend zone. This is a nice friendly zone. I know who I like. <laughs> well, you like Turtle Man, but obviously Turtle Man, you turn down Turtle Man. You just want to be friends with him. Nothing wrong being friends, man. Nothing wrong. Nothing wrong being friends. Voot, 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 voot. Thank you for the two dollar donation, West Haven. That goes for getting my camera, Canon A D D. Best, better camera than the seventy D. Gotta get on the Tinder. Yeah, there you go. I know Mike. She's cool, and I don't want to lose her as a friend. I've known her for a few weeks. She is a medical transporter, transportation driver. I didn't, at least I didn't know you were a medical transportation driver. Wow, I did not know that. Alicia is a medical transportation driver. In other words, if she is in the United States, she could drive a limousine. I'll pray you have a chick pursue you 
like mine pursues me, tur Turtle. Turtle's ta talking about someone else. Not Alicia. Oh, God. I thought, I thought he was talking about Alicia, for God's sake. And the Michael Moore Show is a mod on my life. Yep. Voot. That is very cool. I didn't I didn't get any uh I didn't get any uh phone numbers to do any scam baiting. Hello West, how are you been? A while hope all is well for you. Hope all is well for West Haven as well. Yes, we know. She's in Connecticut too. Five thirty one and now at least what in the world's going on? Hello, Natalisa Osuna. How's the juniors doing? I'm drinking Diet Mountain Dew. And that has a lot of caffeine in it. She lives here in Salem, about an hour away from me. See y'all later. Bad storm coming. Have to get ready. Take care, Steve. We're James 2.0, what's up, bud? Not much. Just shooting the breeze. Summer breeze. Yeah, I live in Salem, turtle. Oh, Alicia Joyce lives in Salem, Oregon, not Salem, Massachusetts. Woo! Mountain Dew, I was just going to get one for my fridge. Are you drinking Mount? You're drinking regular Mountain Dew. You don't need diet. You're slim and trim. And very good looking. What in the hell? Someone watching me? How are you, Natalisa? Somebody's watching you. Boom, 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 boom. I love the music. I can't do music. Well, I've never been to Spain. Pepsi Max is the best. My wife loves Diet Pepsi. And she loves, she's been loving on my Diet 7-Up now. Calls it hers now. What are you drinking, Mike? You're in a good mood. I am. I got plenty of rest um, and relaxation. I'm in a very good mood. I've been drinking Mountain Dew. Diet Mountain Dew. But I want Diet 7-Up, and she says that's hers. I'm going to be drinking some. I'm waiting for it to get cold. I just put it in the fridge at 2 o'clock. Actually, it's about 1.30 I put it in there. I, I, I eat it up two tamales from the tamale lady that comes every Monday. They they bring her tw 20 dollars, 20 bucks. That's good, Mike. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, Mr. Turtle. I hope, I hope you're doing a lot better than before. Except for that girl just wants to be friends. That's the, that's the kiss of death, man. I used to, whenever I used to try to date women... I'd never get a second date, and they'd say, let's just be friends. That's the kiss of death right there. I said, sorry, I don't I don't make friends with, with women. I told them that. If you don't if you don't like me for who I am, I don't make friends with women. I don't drink soda often, but regular Mountain Dew is the best soda ever. Wow. It's got the most caffeine in it, other than Jolt Cola. I just found out I have to do weekly injections to help me lose weight because there's something going on making me gain weight. Said, Hello, Mark Nye. How are you? Good to see you, Mark Nye. Mark Nye, Bill Nye, the science guy. They're like fifth cousins down the road. Why did they stop making Jolt? I don't know. Did they completely stop making Jolt Cola? That had the most caffeine than Mountain Dew. I think Mountain Dew leads the caffeine race in soft drinks. Be right back, says Alicia Joyce from Australia. Mr. Churl, Natalie Soul 7 is watching me and Junior. I'm glad Natalie Soul 7 is here.
The best soda I like is Diet Dr. Pepper. I gotta have a Diet Dr. Pepper. But I also like Seven Up, Diet Seven Up. And I like that a lot. <clears throat> I'm on the road to getting my Canon ADD, guys. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. La, 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 la. Dr. Pepper with peanuts. Never had that combination. I don't have my kids today, so I have more free time. Awesome. We're here till 4 o'clock. Uh, my wife's out of the hospital. She's doing good. Even though she made me get the tamales for her. Oh, wow, Mark, I remember those jolts from those days. I loved those. My mom hated it when I drank those because I get hyper and energetic. I used to drink Joe Cola. used to think it tasted like medicine to me. Where's the live shooting at? At the school that uh, ABC Channel 7 in Los Angeles is talking about. What's for dinner? I don't know what we're having for dinner. Last night we had uh, crock pot chicken. It's pretty good. I had two drumsticks, two big drumsticks. I, of course, they came from Walmart. I don't know what we're having for dinner. What are you having for dinner? Natalie, don't tell me you're having in and out burger. God, if you guys get in and out burger. The last time I called in and out burger, the lady said, it will be before Colorado. Colorado's going to be a 2020. She said the end of the year that In-N-Out Burger will be open. Will be. So we're, apparently we're getting it before Colorado. I might order my barbecue ribs. Oh, God, those ribs are great. That's what you have, should have for dinner. What time is it? Oh, it's morning there. At least that sounds good. Shooting in Colorado. Uh, that's what uh, Reagan... Let me see that. Uh, Regan Benson says he's live. Who's going to get shot today? Shot to death today? Westminster, Colorado. Costco has killer ribs. I'm going to try that. We have one Costco here in Salem. Oh, it's breakfast time for Alicia Joyce. Famous Days Barbecue. I like Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce. It's killer. Them and uh, them and uh, Bullseye Barbecue. Hello, Expert Gaming from Canada. How are you? We uh, we need a Costco in Louisiana. All right, he's from Louisiana. Sorry about that. Famous Dave's Rocks. Is that barbecue sauce, Mark and I? Do they make a barbecue sauce like Sweet Baby Ray's? Thanks for the picture of the food again, Alicia. Darn, you know how to pull heartstrings. Alicia, send me that picture too. Poor Natalie so soon is in Alcatraz Island in San Francisco. Oh man, Mark Nice cooking ribs. Lucky. Alicia Joyce, send me that in Twitter, a picture of it. Lobster. There you go, Ali. Since that's where I want lobster. Woohoo. Too bad Denny's doesn't serve lobster. <laughs> it's barbecue sauce and restaurant chain. Ah. Oh. Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce is the best barbecue sauce in the U.S. But I bet uh, Famous Days. Famous Dave's barbecue sauce is probably good too. Never had them. Hello. I'm the music I'm the music gang video games. I changed my name to Break Break Seventeen. Break six, I mean. They sell their own sauce. Can I get it in Walmart? I like sweet baby rays, guys, I have to admit. Mark and I, damn it, I thought you meant already cooked and just needs to be reheated in the oven. My style of cooking. There you go. Me too. Especially the tamales. When the tamale lady shows up on every Monday. Yesterday she showed up. Showed up early. 
Now, at least I think some Costco's have the pre-cooked ones as well. Oh, there you go. Thank you, Alicia Joyce. I want to see what that food looks like. I'll check it out after my stream or whatever. I love I love looking at food pictures because it makes me want to get it. You can get it at Walmart. Cool. I'll have to try it. Mark and I, yeah, I think I've seen them. Now I'll have to try them. God bless Costco. Is there a Costco on, on freaking Alcatraz Island? You know, I thought Al Capone died there, but he didn't. He died in Florida. I think Juxtapose told me about that. Louisiana does not have a Costco at all. Don't you have a Sam's Club in Louisiana? Found out that not all Costco's carry the same stuff. I did not know that. I think their famous brand is called Sweet and Sassy or Hell Spit. Forget it. Because it's basically a larger and better Walmart. Yes, we have. It's like Sam's Club, more or less. It's not like Walmart. It's similar to Sam's Club, I do believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. It's like Sam's Club, but better. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, Costco's great. We have one. I don't have a card or anything. Crap. I should get one. I have enough money to get one. Just drop phone. No cracks, thank God. Oh, yeah, you don't you don't want to drop your cell phones, guys. Never go to Costco bakery while hungry. Oh god. Mark and I you're already making me hungry with that. Matter of fact, we have the same up the road. Sam oh a Sam? You have Sam's Club. I just looked it up. And there is no difference between the 70D and 80D for shooting video. The only difference, small difference. Yeah, it has ear earphone jack. 3.0 earphone jack. Is how it takes still photos, but they shoot video exactly the same. Okay, gotcha. Maybe I'll use the uh, the photos for the ADD then and upload to my Facebook or something like that. There's Costco in Canada. CA too. Yo, Mikey, you play a what's good and peeps up? Have no now have now fear to cone seven ten to cone seven tier seven ten claims that. He is better than Whataburger and In N Out Burger and Five Guys and Red Robin. I gotta try it. I wanna go up there. Mark and I or go to Costco Hungry period. Oh why hello there, pretty lady Joyce. And pretty lady Natalie Soul Seven. And pretty lady Allie Sensi. Pretty lady, um, Tiara Spark. Good point. I know. I'm still getting the ADD, guys. No matter what, nobody's gonna stop me. <coughs> oh, and it's 24 uh, megapixel as opposed to uh, 70D. 20 megapixels. <coughs> hey, hey, it's Boyin' with Fluffy. How's it going, everyone? It's going great over here, man. Have you got a mic for the camera yet? Not yet. <coughs> I'm going to. I'm going to get it in a bundle. The road mic. Now that I can afford a bundle. For the ADD. And I could put the mic on the 70D, too which is cool. Both the 70D and the 80D have have the uh, can put the road mics on both. So I might use this for uh, video and the other one for loading pictures up to Facebook. 
A really good fast meal is the Costco teriyaki chicken <coughs> with the stir fry veggies. I like the Costco uh, deal where you get the Polish sausage. That's really good. Road to 5K. Yeah, I'll do a 24-hour live stream if I get to 5K, guys. Tell your friends about my channel. I'm doing not too bad. Thanks, Fluffy. I'll message you later. Awesome. Alicia, when are you going to come play with me on my channel? Head to Cone 710. When you do a burger... When you're doing a burger one, I'll be there. Let me know when you're doing a burger one. <coughs> I want to see your burger joint, dude. Terracot sounds good. Incredible right now. I just got a rice maker. Lobster sounds good to me right now. <coughs> I want a lobster. I want double, double the, double the lobster. Exploring Fluffy says, I have a cool video coming out pretty soon. Secret video. Can't tell the name of it. Ah, Mikey, I'll do it. The Decone710Yahoo.com. You show up and I'll give it to you free, for free. Wow. If I show up to your pad, I'll get up the best the best burger that you got. I'm there. I'll just buy the drinks, the sodas. Costco also has reasonable priced lobster, really. But the only thing it is, my wife doesn't cook lobster, darn it. <coughs> she doesn't grill it either. Looking forward to it, Fluffy. Mm, lobster, yeah. Insert Boston accent lobster. I think I think Juxtapose can do that. I don't know what that was. Yeah, man. Sweet. And I'll pay for my wife's burger. <laughs> I get my burger free. She ha I have to pay for hers. <laughs> Have a nice day. Oh, wait. Have a good day. There you go. Yep. Honey Crips and Fujis. All right. I want the best burger you cook, man. Wicked Lobster. I'm here till four, guys. You guys rule, man. Somebody's watching you. Now Turtle Man's got me into that song. I'm from a land down and die. I'm starting to feel a little tired, but I'm going to be okay. I'm going to be okay. Whoop up. Blah, blah. You don't, the Cone 710, you don't cook lobsters, do you? The best burger, it's whatever you think think you can whatever think you think of would be ingredients I have whatever your favorite burger is I'll make it now we'll have your favorite burger wow I need some more caffeine drink a Mountain Dew that'll help you just Santa Toter Stefan oh I'm new here will you please hit my subscribe button and hit the bell icon. If you're new, please hit it. And where are you from? <coughs> Can I just call you Stefan? As opposed to Gwen Stefani? Dark magic for the Keurig. There it is. Oh, no. That, that's not it. Darn it. I do, and I'm from Bavaria, Germany, and 
Ja, Stefan is okay. All right, Stefan. Good night. Good night, James 2.0. Is that on the east coast of Germany or the west coast? There, there it is. It went up. Where's your sister wife? Ray Gonzalez. I don't know. I'm not into cocaine. Cocaine is into me and I don't really like cocaine. But I sure love the way it smells. Wow. Bavaria, in my opinion. Best beer ever. Mark Nye, is that on the East Germany or West Germany, Bavaria? Never heard of it. South Germany, or better called the place with Oktoberfest. Oh, you guys started Oktoberfest. There you go. I'll get the best beer that Natalie has ever had at Fisherman's Wharf in San Francisco. Germany only has a north coast. They don't have a south coast. You drive ambulances? How do you know all this DJ Southpaw that he drives an ambulance? Their ambulance horn in Germany sounds like this. That's, that's the German ambulance sound. Not an ambulance, but I'm a chimney swipper sweeper so i bring you all in the stream luck cool i'll need all i can get laugh loud what i'll get you the best best beer and fisherman's wharf <laughs> uh oh natalie so soon it doesn't like beer and junior's not allowed to drink it man if i had a kid i no, i wouldn't do that love vinegar Ugh. Don't put vinegar on my burger, please, to cone 710. I don't like vinegar. Oh, Javeria. Have much beer. Oh, yeah. To cone 710. Laugh out loud. <laughs> Nelly is so soon. It's still stuck at Alcatraz. Fisherman's Wharf. Now I'm having food flashbacks. I love Fisherman's Wharf. I had abalone there. It was very good. I love beer. Oh, she loves beer. Well, I'll get you. Hello, Spooky. I'll get you the best beer, man. <laughs> Heineken. Where, what country does Heineken come from? Is that German beer? Or is that Dutch beer? Chowder and bread bowls. Uh, I'm not much of a... Clam chowder bread bowler, but my wife is. She likes that stuff. Long time no see, Natalie. So Osuna, she had her. She's had her kids, so she did, she took a break from kids today. No kids zone at Natalie. So. Hello, exploring with Fluffy. How's it going, bro? I think he left, Mister Turtle. I think he's gone. Those are the bomb, Mark. What are the bomb? Oh, oh, I'm not a big... Moe's clam chowder has that, the bread bowls, but I'm not into it. I'm just like a... Uh, Moe's clam chowder, I think, is the best clam... Well, I've never been to Jake's. Jake's is expensive. Jake's in Portland. Probably the best fish place you can go. But it's expensive as all get out. Yum, yeah, Mark. Soft pretzels with mustard. Ah, now you're talking state fair, Mark. State fair food is very good. Juxtapose, I know. I've had my kids for almost two weeks straight, so not much. Free time now. Oh, it, it's uh, Easter, Easter vacation for both juniors. So, Natalie so soon has to homeschool juniors for a couple of weeks. I have a question. Do you ever was in Germany and do you guys have chimney sweepers? I don't know what chimney sweepers are. Uh, I've never been to Germany. My first cousin did. 
he left San Francisco. He used, to, he used to be a taxi cab driver in San Francisco. And he was in the band called The Hedge. If anybody knows The Hedge in San Francisco, that was his... He played bass guitar, and he moved... He uh, quit taxi car driving in uh, San Francisco and moved to Germany. He says Germany... He loved Germany. He says he hated the United States of America. America does have chimney sweeps. I didn't know that. I don't even know what the flip of chimney sweeper is. Yes, we get our chimneys cleaned in the U.S. or it can catch fire if you don't. We don't have a chimney here in this apartment, thank God. I don't want to deal with that. But my cousin lived in Germany, said Germany is the best place. Of course, he lived in East Berlin, where the wall came down. And Reagan said, Gorbachev, tear down that wall. And sure enough, Gorbachev in Germany tore down the wall. I would have loved to have had, I want another brick in the wall. Bum, bum, Pink Floyd. I watched my neighbor's chimney catch fire. Wow, that sucks. They don't chimney sweep in Alcatraz where Natalie Sosuna lives. Wait, she's in... Wait. Natalie Sosuna's in Berkeley. She went to UC Berkeley, man. She's smart. She's a genius. She's smarter than Dr. Shockley. We had a duck come down at out chimney once and it was just hissing at us from our fireplace. Wow. Germany is the best. And if you love beer, come I don't I cannot drink beer. I'm a diabetic for one. And number two, I'm from the Church of Jesus Christ, Latter-day Saints. We don't drink beer. The good saints don't drink beer. The bad saints drink beer. Berkeley. Um, no. I thought you were in Berkeley, for God's sake. And I thought you went to UC... Oh, you went to Chico State, which is an extension of Berkeley. University of California. In, at Berkeley. They have all, all the riots there. Light that sucker up and have dinner. The Cajun Ninja. Where did the term Natalisa Osuna come from? <laughs> <laughs> from a baseball pitcher named Osuna. I think he played for the Miami Marlins. Berkeley ain't my thing. Oh, good. That's right. Berkeley ain't my thing either. <coughs> Why do ducks have flat feet? Because they because they're Webster Webfoot? I don't know. Cajun Ninja, good question. Natalie Osuna, there was a guy named Osuna. His last name was Osuna. And O seven brought me back to Osuna. He was a baseball pitcher. Was it his first name Natalie so no, Osuna was his last name. Ugh, another school shooting today. Where? Was that in Colorado or Los Angeles? Well, some Bavarians have Diabetes and Bavaria, it created a beer without alk and sugar. Ooh, I would like to try that one. That they can drink it or something. Ah, there we go. Eins, zwei, drei, scheiße, nixiesen. Sprechen Sie Deutsch. Nixiesen. Scheiße. Scheiße, nixiesen. In a school shooting. Wait, just Colorado. Oh, Colorado had the school shooting? I thought L.A. had one, too. Where is it? ABC is live now. School shooting. Officials give update after at least two people. Wow. Wow. Oh, man. 
I got family in Colorado. I'm kind of nervous. One, two, three. Scheisenick Schiessen. Okay. In Germany at 12 midnight now. Well, it's 3 o'clock here. Got one more hour. Oh my God, it was in Highlands Ranch. That's where my cousin and her kids live. Where the flip is Highlands Ranch? Is that the school shooting in Colorado? Juxtapose? <sighs> It was a middle. It was at a middle school. I'm glad I don't work at Salem Kaiser Middle School anymore. Southwest of Denver. Wow. Ever remember Colin Bine was a friend of mine. That's the last shooting they had. Oh wait, they had a movie theater shooting in Colorado too a few years ago. What well, question do you guys? can really buy guns anywhere at Walmarts. I don't know. Do you have Walmart in Germany? I didn't know they have. They call it Al Aldi's in uh, Aldic, Aldic, Aldix in England, which is owned by Walmart. While I do believe in responsible gun ownership, I'd be terrified to go to school nowadays. So would I. I'm glad I don't work for schools. I retired, man. I used to work for Los Angeles Unified School District and Salem Kaiser School District. We have Aldi and Oh, you do? Is it is it pronounced Aldi? 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 They're they're owned by Walmart, man. So you guys have, actually have Walmart. Cool. In Germany, you can't buy guns anywhere. Only beer. Yeah, you can be sixteen and and drink beer, right? In Germany. They have good German beer. Heineken's one of them. What's another good ger German beer? Walmart used to sell long guns and some might still. You can buy hunting rifles at Walmart. Ali Sensi, remember, we're not going near the gun rack in, at Walmart it's this Sunday. Stay away. AS, Asda is Walmart. Aldi is its own oh Al okay Aldi is not Walmart as they have Asda in England I don't think they have Asda in Australia gotta go I'm having anxiety to I'm sorry tax found out I may have to pay full price less than 900 bucks for four injections I'm not doing good right now see all it mr. turtle take care buddy Bitburger is my favorite German beer. Never heard of it. Germany have Aldi, Netto, Lidl, Real, Equal, Walmart. There you go. My brother lived in Germany, man. In the army. He, had, he got a house there or something. Even here in the northwest, the Walmart still sell long guns. Didn't know that. They sell it the Walmart I'm going to be at. I mean, we're going to the McDonald's and ha and doing a live, right, Allie? Is that cool or not? When I get one, I just want a handgun for self and home protection. Here in Australia, Aldi's. Do you have an Aldi's? Yeah, our Walmart only has paintball, airsoft, and BB guns. Wow. Where do you get a Bitterburger, Alicia? Do they have Bitterburger in Germany? I've never heard of it. My local liquor drive-thru, she gets it. Wow, you could drive drive through a liquor store? They need one of those here. Hello. I actually don't want one here. Hi. I always want to go to Australia. Hi. Well, you can go without a passport if you live in Germany. You guys share the same queen. <laughs> Germany doesn't doesn't have a queen. I thought Angela Merkel was a queen. What is she anyway? Hey Siri, who's the president of Germany? The answer I found is Frank Walter Steinmeier. 
Oh, he's Jewish too. Wow, how did a Jewish guy get in there? Stein Steinmeier's Jewish name. He's the president. He's an old guy with the glasses. See so a Republican or Democrat? I'll bet you he's a Democrat. Can you imagine if he turned out to be Hitler again? Germany have a lot of beer products. Bitburger, Paulana, Radler, Gosmas. I could say Bitburger easy. That that's they sell that in Hamburg, Germany. And they sell a lot of hamburgers in Germany. In Hamburg. Oh my god, I forgot about drive through liquor stores. I was in Florida once. They have them? I didn't know that. I wish we had drive through weed shops. Yeah, that'd be cool. What, weed's not legal in Australia, for God's sake. And not in England, either. But you can still get weed. Message me later, Alicia, if you want. Yeah, go message her. I remember they had rum and coke in a can, too. Wow. What do they sell in Frankfurt? They sell Frankfurters in Frankfurt. <laughs> Is that the state capital of Germany? Frankfurt? I think that's where that Walter guy lives. Will do, Turtle. I won't be around tomorrow. I'll be busy most of the day. Oh, crap. Busy as a bee. We have car washes. Yeah, we have car washes here, too. It's good that you have car washes. State capital of Kentucky. Frankfurt. I got that. Hey, Kentucky used to be Germany. <laughs> Almost. If we hadn't gotten in World War II, they would be. Well, you can say it, but Germany say it in another way. And yeah, I know where Frankfurt is. Is that East Germany? What's the city in East in East Berlin, man, where they tore down the wall. They Americanized that, man. Reagan told them, Gorbachev, tear down the wall, and the wall came down. Now Trump wants to build up a wall. Go figure. Once that wall gets built, and Mexico ends up paying for it, we'll have to take it down. <laughs> there'll be a president that there'll be a Republican president that says, tear down that wall. There is no East Germany, West Germany. Oh, I didn't know that. There used to be. Brandenburg is the way you mean. Where's Brandenburg? Sounds like Vandenberg. Vandenberg Air Force Base in, in uh, California. Why is Germany into Scheiße porn? Crap porn. Oh God, I don't know why it is. Crap porn. Germany reunited in 1989. Yeah, but do you still trust them, Mark and I? I got 240 likes on a comment. Who wants my autograph? All right, junk drawer from Canada. What is Shiza porn? It's crap porn, man. I can't say though. S H I T word. Shot is shy as a crap porn. At least he speaks English, man. When, uh oh, someone's knocking at the door. It's not the tamale lady, it's probably a nurse. Hold on, guys. Let's see who it is. It's not my wife. Oh, it is a nurse. It is Terry. Is, is it Ter Terry McEntee? Terry Rowland, but close. Terry Rowland. Oh, I was close. <laughs> I hit the nail on the head, yeah. Terry. Are you from Kaiser? No, from Willamette Valley Palliative Care. And so I'm here to see... W Willamette Valley what? Willamette Valley Palliative Care. That's a big mouthful of words. W Willamette, damn it. Are you for Becky? I am for... Oh, is Becky home from the hospital? Yeah. I'm here for Lisa. Oh, you know Becky too? Well, she when the last time I was here seeing Lisa, she told me her sister was in the hospital, or your wife was in the hospital at the time. Yeah, she was. And I could hear her on the other line, and I said hello to her through the phone. Oh, so you're here for Lisa. I'm here for Lisa. Oh, Lisa. 
Lisa Walker. Correct? Lisa Walker. Texas Ranger. Texas Walker, Texas, Texas Ranger. Ranger. Yes, exactly. Remember that? Yeah. Well, come on that in. That was a little bit before my. No, it was. It was about my time. Yeah. Uh, you don't remember seeing Chuck Norris in it? He wasn't my favorite. Oh, who's your favorite? He's Bruce fake, Lee, right? Bruce, Bruce Lee is a Bruce lot. Lee's authentic. Yeah, uh, of course. Or Evo, or Evo Knievel, even. Evo. He just, he did that, too? Yeah. No. He jumped the crank. He, he, might, have, he might as well have. Yeah. school shooting in middle school in Colorado. I just yeah. saw that on my phone. What was it like? I saw it on my phone, too. I it just saw a little blurb of it flash. Was it an ABC? Or? I, I don't know. Uh, all right, well. Lisa, where are you? She's in there, I think the right, if she's not in there, she's in the left. But check the right first, because that's her room. The right hand one. Yeah, Lisa? that one. It's Terry. It's Terry Macachu. Do you miss me? I guess so. I didn't know we had a nurse. A nurse is visiting Lisa. Lisa uh, Natalie Sa 07, a nurse is visiting you right now. <laughs> Jackie Chan, yeah. Awesome. Uh, no one in Germany watched that kind of porn. But there is a funny insider. Quit. Quinn. One girl, two cups video. Uh oh, ask her for spaghetti, a sponge bath. No, that's the least I think. My mother used to give me those, I hated them. Ugh, yuck. I thought most shy crap videos came out of Germany like two girls, one cup. Uh oh, Tiara Spark says, Uh oh, hope she's not mad at me. Oh, Mike. When you step away from the lies, you need to start muting your mic. Uh, okay. But I, I'm, for, I'm for freedom of speech, D.R. Park. <laughs> Uh-oh. What happened? Um, I'll try to remember that. I keep forgetting. I love you, Tiara Spark. I love you, love you, love you. And we love England, but we don't like President Theresa May. Get rid of her. Impeach her at once. I'd be yelling on the rooftops on that, and they'd arrest me and put me in Scotland Yard, for God's sake. You will find on Sunday we have an odd sense of humor. Both you you and uh, Eva and, and me, too, or no? Nope, Germany not even allowed to make or watch that kind of porn, huh? Oh, I love you. Oops. Love you, Tiara Spark from England. See? England fought off Germany. Winston, president Winston Churchill, the best president England's ever had. Everybody loved Winston Churchill. Yes, indeed. Hello, Mike. I'm extremely happy right now. My football soccer team, Liverpool. Are you in Liverpool right now? Made a comeback in a the champ Champions League semifinal from 3-0 down. Cool. Boston Red Sox did that to the Yankees. Three. I was so happy to see that. It's never been done in World Series. When you're 0-3 to three in the World Series, there's never been a 4-3 a game. I mean... Boston did it in, in the playoffs, but not in the World Series. It would have been the first of the World Series. Unless there's something confidential, try not to mute, because if there is dead air on a live stream, people will leave quickly. Good points, guys. I, I, I just wanted to... Yep, I live in Liverpool. Scouser, born and bred. What's a Scouser? the bloody hell <laughs> what is a bloody hell scouser I've never heard of these terms you you guys in old England need to help me with the lingo <laughs> old England I meant the United Kingdom for God's sake and you're not allowed to say F Theresa May either and yell out from the rooftops that should be made legal eh Michael what's with your legs. I see you are with wheels. Yeah, I'm, I've got wheels, all right. I am a diabetic, and 
I never knew it until they found out. So they was taken to the hospital. They cut off my leg, man. They sawed it off. No. They, I don't have a leg, man. I got an amputated. Yes, but you never know what can be said while away from PC juxtaposition. So it's better for him to mute for a few minutes. I don't know, man. Flat Earth or not. Elon Musk, I don't believe in a flat Earth. I think it's round. Christopher Columbus proved it. Mike can only speak American, not English. I wish I could speak American. I must admit it was funny. You nursing the nurse as your mother's... What? Me, a.k.a. Terry McAtee. Yeah. She, oh, the the JJ, yep. Is that what Terry McAtee means? I never knew that. I always called the scammers that. A scouser is someone from Liverpool. How are you, by the way? I'm doing great, man. I love England. Tiara Spark, yeah. If a nurse shows up, it's probably going to be confidential. Eh, I was just talking to her in general. I thought she was seeing uh, my wife. And my wife and my sister-in-law didn't, didn't think there'd be anybody coming today. They didn't tell me, obviously. The earth is round. There's no debate. That is ridiculous. I agree, Ali Sensi, yeah. Anyone that says the earth is flat is crazy, in my opinion. I wish I could speak Japan. My, my brother actually does speak Japanese. Wait, you and Germany were allies, man, during World War II. You better watch it. Japan tried to take over the world like Germany did. I'd either be... if If... Hitler would have won the war, I would be speaking German, not English. And if Japan would have taken over, I'd be speaking Japanese and German. So there you go. Actually, this is spheroid. It's not perfect. No, we know it's... But to the flat earthers, it's definitely not flat. Should have asked her for identification. She could be an imposter nurse, spy from the Church of Scientology. I'll ask her when she comes out. Remind me. And I'll keep, I won't mute the mic when I ask her. I wonder if some nurse is going to show up for Becky now. They all came in for Becky. Are you done or no? Oh, no, just start. Oh. I just need hot water. What was I... Ex oh, are you from Scientology? Oh, God, no. <laughs> oh, you don't like Scientology either? Oh, I don't like Scientology. You could say you don't like it. Uh, I just don't know. Well, what I do know about, I would rather just leave it at that. Oh, you watch the Lee Remini series, right? Yeah, probably. Huh? Yeah. I, oh, there we got one. I'm going to audit the, the uh, Scientology in Portland because they don't have one here. <laughs> I'm going to do a I'm going to do a video audit on my YouTube channel. Hey, I'm wondering. What? You need you more? if I look for a little bit of olive oil or vegetable oil? Oh, you got some right here. Well, use it if you need it. I just, I like it in bath water, believe it or not. Or soapy water. I don't think I have damn green. As in Doc's... You are hilarious, Michael. You're laughing at least. Hey, I make jokes of everything. This country, all countries I make jokes of. That sounds like something a Scientologist nurse spy would say. Are you a spy for Scientology? <laughs> no, I guess not. I'm going to audit them. All right, you do it. All right, thanks, Doc. <laughs> I call her doctor, too. I'll, she is having a bath at your place when I have you use your own bath nurse. <laughs> hey, at least England, you don't have home health nurses like they have here. I detest it. I like in English because every German must learn English in school. Does anyone learn German in your schools or something? If you take German in, in high school and junior high, I guess you can. We do. I forgot something in my car. I'm going to be right back. Uh oh, you Is guys. Is it okay if I let myself back? Yes, you don't have to knock. Just Got come it. on in. Mi casa, su casa. Awesome. My house is your house, nurse. 
<laughs> we do have home nurse. Oh, God. Are they free? Do they charge anything? Most schools require a second language. French, Spanish, German. If you're planning to go to college, if you're in high school. Kids barely learn English in the U.S. Yeah, they speak Ebonics, man. I'm just joking. It's a joke. It's a joke. Jeez, don't get See, Tiara Spark got my joke. She gone to get the rope and black bag. She's going to get the rest of the Scientology from the car. That's all I need is Scientology. She doesn't like Scientology. She said that. Our, our home nurses are free. So are uh, in England, too. They're free. Freaking, why can't we get on the dole here and have the dole instead of welfare? We need the dole here. Don't you agree we need the dole instead of welfare, like in England, and free health care? Anything socialized is all right by me. Right on. Oh, you're a Bernie Sanders supporter. All right. Or Elizabeth Warren, actually. Either one of those two, huh? Yeah, I like it. Cool. Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> the second language in Chicago school is slang. Me, I only speak English, French, and Korean. Wow. Germany have home nurses, and they hot, they not spies. Only double agents. Socialism. Do you like that juxtapose? Do you like what Bernie Sanders? I lived in Chicago. For Jack Drawer, where are you living now? What state again? Is it Louisiana, you said? or I'm trying to remember. The dole isn't good thing isn't a good thing really it gets abused a lot by people who just claim it when they're too lazy to work the government needs to give it to people who need it that sounds like america <laughs> you know the dole is part of socialism what side junk drawer south korea has work fair not welfare so does the uh, church of jesus christ of latter-day saints if they give you money, you have to work for the church. Wisconsin. Oh, that's right. You're cheesehead. This is awesome. Yes, indeed. Problem there is they take it off those people that actually need it. Wow. Socialism. Socialism. I agree with juxtapose. Socialism is almost communism. Actually, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints practiced uh, socialism, the United Order. That was part of that. I mean, not socialism, communism, where you give to the church, uh, the church, you give to the church, and the church dis distributes to people. Germany don't have a. You call it maybe a P and J sandwich. Oh, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. When you said dole, I. Thought you meant the pineapple juice company. Bob Dole uh, was part as related to the pineapple juice. Well, he was until he died. But when I said Dole, that's what, when I go to England and live there. I want to be on the Dole, people. I'm already retired. I wonder what they call it. Call retirement, and they probably still call it the Dole, right? Bert and Ernie equals Bernie. That's pretty good. Yes, indeed, is from Liverpool. From Liverpool. I'd love to visit Liverpool, London, and where Tiara Spark lives. I'd love to, live, love to visit there. Bernie is a normal German name. I didn't know that. Maybe Bernie Sanders is part Jewish, part German. He could be a German Jew. Who knows? I'm not being anti-Semite. My daughter's Jewish, for God's sake. Junk drawer. I'm on the south side near Rose Lawn. I think you'd enjoy Liverpool. Never been to London myself. Not even been around the UK much. Ah. I would enjoy the good parts of Liverpool. I don't want to visit the bad parts of Liverpool. I want to visit where the Beatles. Because the Beatles are my favorite band of all time. And the United Kingdom gave us the Beatles. Yes, England gave us the Beatles. Woohoo! Thank you, England. See, I knew we were friends of England. 
TJ Zafa, give me your internet. In internets. <laughs> Whatever that means. Oh, was in Liverpool for the weekend. What a city. I was in the cat cav what's the cavern? Mokela, do you live in England too? How old are you by the way? You look like forty fifty. I'm sixty six. Be sixty seven on Canada Day. All of Canada celebrates my birthday, July 1st. It's 6.30, I need to get going. Open the clinic at 4.30 a.m. Okay, Mark and I take care. God bless you. Where the Beatles played. You were in Liverpool where the Beatles played? What pub was that, anyway? Pete Best used to be in the Beatles. DJ got gigabyte internet service, and I'm completely jealous. I don't know what that is. Liverpool is made out to be worse than it is sometimes. Most of the crimes that get committed are related to drugs and aren't on purely innocent people most of the time. Well, keep me away from that bad part of Liverpool. I don't take drugs. My birthday is on the 22nd of July. I follow a Chicago-based fishing website called Chai Town Angler. It's a great fishing website. Cool. What state are you in, junk, tr junk drawer? My memory is failing me. I hate that. The cavern wasn't the first place the Beatles played. They played in some club in Manchester, I think, and then played in the cavern. Oh, that's where the Beatles played in Liverpool? They weren't famous back then either, right? When they played at the cavern. I'm in Wisconsin. That's right. Cheesehead. Cheesehead. I keep thinking you're a cheesehead. I don't think I could live there. It snows. They played there over 200 times in two years. Wow. Drug war is nonsense legalized, says Elon Musk. Ver Vrika from Scandinavia. Hi, Michael. No, I mean Norway, excuse me. In Norway, we pay lots of taxes, but we have free hospital pay little a year for doctors, $275 in a year. If you pay more, you have free doctors. Wow. No, they were, they were an up-and-coming local band, really, at the Cavern. See, I want to visit the Cavern. Is that a pub or what? Nightclub? What is it? Workout time. This is my workout video today. Cool. Thought you were working out right now. I can hardly wait to meet you, Ali Sensi. Malcolm is a subscriber of mine. He lives in uh, Los Angeles or outside of Los Angeles, California. And I met him in junior high school. So he's a, he's a YouTuber. My wife's a YouTuber. I've met her. So I met two. And I met Ali Sensi's uh, Eva. So that's three. I, I, I know three people from YouTube. That's it. Workout video. Are we in the 90s? Is it hosted by Richard Simmons? Oh, God. Richard yes, legalize all drugs. It's a club. The city center of Liverpool is definitely a place you should visit. Trust me. The city isn't rough, really. Even the rough areas are safe to walk around. Well, you, you, don't, you can't carry a gun there, right? Elon Musk. Yeah, Malloy Pub. Elon Musk, you're in England, right? Your icon sideways. Wow. I always watch stuff while doing this. And yes, like needs oldies and a Simmons wit, wig. My mom met Richard Simmons back in the day. Wow. Did she like him or something? Elon Musk, where are you? where's Elon Musk from? Juxtapose the real Elon Musk, not the fake one. No, we can't carry guns, and we can only carry non-lockable knives that are under three inches. See, nobody shoots anyone in England. Even the Bobbies don't shoot anyone in England. So England's a gun-free zone, the whole whole country. That must be nice. How come we can't do that here? 
no, I guess we, the Second Amendment people would have a fit. Oh, oh, Elon, okay, so then is this Elon Musk from South Africa too? That was owned by England too. It's great. See, Tiara Spark says no guns allowed. She likes that. She's laughing her head off right now as we speak. I agree. I think it's good. I think it's kind of good. I don't know. Nope. I'm a German Leatherhosen. Are you in Elon Musk here in Germany too? Are you in East Berlin or West Berlin? Only weak, weak but pieces of crap carry guns and knives. Well, they don't have guns, man. Even the robbers don't have even even robbers don't have guns anymore. You know, if a bobby catches them, they're dead meat. They go to Scotland Yard. Bring Scotland Yard back to Scotland where it belongs, and get out of the European Union, England, so you could have your first Independence Day. Elon Musk has South African Canadian use. You, he has a triple, triple citizenship. You you can actually do that. I didn't know you could do. I knew you could have dual. I didn't know you could have triple citizenship. I'd love to have an England citizenship, an Australian one, and a Canada one. New Zealand, f New Zealand. Wait, I better not f that. I have a rocket in my. Oh, okay, gotcha. <laughs> Hope it doesn't blast off too often. With lots of money, you can do anything. Wow. Yeah, you could buy off the cops <clears throat> like Scientology does in Los Angeles. They bought off the LAPD. They don't do a Hoover damn thing. They're always for the Scientologists. Our self-defense laws are ridiculous. A prisoner stabbed a robber who broke into his home in order to protect his wife and almost has to serve prison time. Whoa. I think a court of law does that here. Especially if someone comes into your place, I think you can shoot them dead. They're allowed to have rifles, shotguns in England. Can they carry them? The pensioner was in his 70s. What's a pen? Prisoner or pension? What's a pensioner? I don't know what... It, hi. Uh, bum, how are you? I'm not going to say your full name. Bum, how are you doing? A retired person. I, I'm retired. Person over 60. So, I'm... Uh, so... If I moved to England, I would be a pensioner, right? Or retired. What age can you retire at? I'll just go on the dole. I'll go on the bloody dole in England. I deserve it. I can't work. <laughs> I want to be on the dole in England. The dole probably doesn't pay out that much, right? We can't carry guns. We have to have strict license to own a gun. Only farmers can own guns, really. Ah, oh, gotcha. I'm learning a lot about England. You would be a pensioner. Oh, cool. So I wouldn't have to go on the dole. There you go. I'm a pensioner, guys. That's what they call retired people. We call that social security here in the United States, which people think it's going to go bankrupt, and it's not. That's a scare tactic by political pundits. I'm still on social security. It's not going away. You would get personal independent payment and ESA employment and support allowance. So, pensioner gets that, which is I am. So, I get personal. Would I get free health care there? I want to learn more about England. So do I, DJ Southpaw. We're our, we're, they're our allies. They're our friends. They gave us the English language, for God's sake. And we threw the Boston Tea Party away in the ocean, man. No, that's for people who can't work. Ah. Oh. So I would get that, though, right? 
because I can't work. Well, I'm 66. Social Security is going to go away. No, it's not. It's really broken and barely covers living expenses today. They'll call it something else. Maybe they can call it pensioner. You would get a pensioner benefit as well. Wow, that's cool. Pensioners usually pay pensions all their life and then when they retire, they get paid a certain amount a month from the pension company. You do get free health care in hospitals, though. Yeah, see? I want to live in England. I can be a pensioner. Since Social Security is going away, since Chuck Post says it is, which I don't think it is, but if it goes away, I think they'll call it a different name so it won't go away completely. It's good. I'll, I'll be a pensioner. I want to live in England to be a pensioner, for God's sake. But it, it snows all in the whole country of England, right? I, I, I don't need snow. Social Security won't go away in your lifetime, but it will eventually. Ah, I hope, well, I hope you're not right, juxtaposed, because everyone puts into Social Security. At least I think they do. The coolest female on the planet lives in England. I agree, DJ Sal. She should be the she should be the president of England, Tiara Spark. Our national health system is corrupt, crumbling slightly under the weight of our government, says the guy from Liverpool. Yes, indeed. You know why? Because they tax you guys a lot. They ta tax you with a lot of pence. And pounds. And uh, what is, what's the other thing? The, I forget. Moldy old cheese boiled milk. Hello. Are you from England too? We get, we get taxed just for farting. Oh my God. The taxes too low for the NHS. It needs to be higher. Why? Wow, he wants to raise taxes. Yes, indeed, it must be a Democrat. It should be lowered for other things, however. Oh, oh wait, now he's a, re he's a re Republicrat. <laughs> the more money, the more, the more money you put into Social Security is supposed to be there when you retire, but it's not the money young people are putting into it is paying for the retired people now. Thank God, thank God I'm a baby, baby, baby boomer. Damn, I can't even speak. Boiled milk. Only, only for the NHS because it isn't receiving enough money. Social Security is really behind and will never catch up rats. And trust me, I'm very right wing. Oh, okay. Wait. So did you did you vote for <laughs> President <laughs> Theresa May? If you're right wing, she's a right winger, man. It's three thirty eight. It's Theresa May seventh. Invest your savings and not with the government. That's what they used to tell me when I was uh, a baby boomer in, in junior high and high school. But I never did. Oh, and then I work, when I worked for Los Angeles United you know, School District, they wanted me to invest that way too. Um, a different company that was able to go in and, and try and talk you to invest in their plan, like a 401k plan or whatever. I couldn't. I'm not old enough, unfortunately. Oh, wait, how old are you? Yes, indeed. You're not allowed to vote? Because you're too young. How old do you have to be to be in England to vote? And you don't vote. You don't vote for the person. You vote for the bloody part. Oh, you're only 16. Ah, oh, crap. But you know a lot about the Beatles, dude. I'd love to have you on panel one of these days. Moldy old cheese boiled milk, Riley. Ah, uh, thank you. You have to be 18 to vote. Oh, okay, it's like here. Yeah, they tell people younger than me to rely on Social Security. You must get a 401k and or IRA if you want to retire without being broke. Wow. That never
never ceases to amaze me. Never ceases to amaze me. I think if I was your age and you think that Social Security's going broke, yeah, an investment in a 401k or IRA would be good. Unless the government goes bankrupt, then you're SOL, I think. I only like 90s, 80s, and 70s music. I don't give new music a listen. Ah, I see. I hope I'm grandfathered into Social Security where it doesn't go bankrupt. Juxtapose thinks I'll make it. Hello, Riley. Riley, was that you? Were you uh, moldy old cheese boiled milk? Was that you, Riley? If it was you doing a joke, I don't appreciate that. Who's your favorite band or singer? My favorite band of all time, I've, I told you before, is the Beatles. I love the Beatles. I wouldn't have juxtaposed. Don't depend on them to have your best interest in mind when it comes to your retirement. So DJ says don't get a 401k or don't get, uh, don't get an IRA. Yeah, like I, DJ, if they go bankrupt, you're SOL out of your money. So that kind of sucks. Put your money under the, under the mattress, under the bed, man. My, my favorite singer is Paul McCartney, man. I love that guy. My favorite song of all time is Led Zeppelin. They come from England. Stairway to Heaven is my favorite song. Hide your money under the mattress. Yeah, there you go. Don't put it in the bank. If the freaking government bankrupts, the bank banks won't have it. Everything, though, even though I'm from Liverpool, I have to admit, I'm not that big of a fan of the... Oh, yikes! Well, you're only 16 years old. If you are older, don't do that. It's the first place people look. Oh, yeah, the government will look under your mattress. Hide it in a wall safe, then. <laughs> I actually have a safe. No, Michael, not a 401k. Don't hope Social Security will be there. 401k is a good way to go. There you go, DJ Southpaw. That's why I suggest uh, all, all of you young bucks at age 30 and above should go into that. I didn't myself, and I could have or should have, but hey, I figured I'd be set for life anyway because my well-to-do mother supplied that for me. And she's gone now, which I love her dearly. I love my father, who's Catholic, Irish Catholic. I mean, a few of my friends like the Beatles, but I'm more into singers like David Bowie. David Bowie's cool. My favorite genre, however, is metal. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, 401k or IRA will be the only way to survive. So juxtapose, put it in one of those two or both, I don't know. Especially a Roth IRA, so you don't have to worry about taxes as much. There you go. The baby boomers left us a mess. I would, I would say uh, my mother's generation left us a mess. That's what I think. <clears throat> my mother and father's generation left left us all a mess because you guys had uh, they they voted for uh, Herbert Hoover for God's sake he was he was I think he's the worst president we've ever had he gave us the depression for God's sake and he was a Republican and I'm I'm GOP too so Theresa May's a Republican. It's all the silent generation's fault. <laughs> Eventually, Generation Z don't know what those kids are talking about anymore. <coughs> Where's Generation Z? What's that? Babies, right, that are born now? Like, I'm going to have a grandson in June. Hopefully, it's June 6th or June 12th. Back then weren't Republicans more left leaning and Democrats were more right leaning 
good point. I'm not sure. Because my, my mother was a Democrat during the uh, FDR Truman era. But when Ike, when Eisenhower ran for president, she, she became a Republican and never went back. And my grandmother on my mother's side, my mother's mother, my grandmother, she was a Democrat. Generation Z is current. Yeah, prior to that is millennials, which I am Generation X. Generation Z is what comes after millennials. I don't know any of that. The party switched ideals in 62, which John F. Kennedy was the president, Democrat. And he got shot in 1963 by Lee Harvey Oswald. Don't tell me the conspiracy theories are coming in. Spread your money into as many investments as you can. Buy real estate, 401k, 401k, open up your own mutual funds, etc. TJ Southpaw's rich. He can do all that. I can't. I suppose... I'm Generation Z then. You're 16 years old. So is that, gen is that Generation Z? I'm a baby boomer. I didn't mess things up, man. It's my parents that mess. It's their generation that messed all hell to break loose. Yeah, I just fall under the millennial group. Ah. X is the 40, 50 something. That be me, Generation X. I'm baby boomer. Trust me. Whatever generation my parents came from screwed up everything. XX. JFK was a good president. He was. If I may say so myself, although he caused a lot of anxiety in the Cuban Missile Crisis, he did genuinely care about America. Hey, it had to be done. JFK, man, was awesome during the mis mis missile, the Bay of Pigs and the Missile Park Crisis. It's too bad Lee Harvey Oswald shot him and killed him. Look at all those wrenches. Cerberus. Hello. Gen Z, as the group of kids, teens, and young adults, roughly between the ages 7 and 22. And Okay, so that, that applies to... Uh, Yes, indeed. He's Generation Z. Rules. There you go. Thank you. DJ Southpaw. <clears throat> Please read those rules. I've got 12 minutes left. i got to sign off. Otherwise, my wife will kill me. I get paid by YouTube on May 21st. Unless that falls on a Saturday or Sunday. Then I'll get it Monday. Thank you, YouTube, for letting me do this. What's your favorite book? I don't really have a favorite book. I think I said the Book of Mormon. Oh, we love you. Cerberus, all right. The baby boomers made things really bad. The generation before was what made the economy great that caused the baby boom. Now we are left in the wake of the boom and everything is messed up. Now, I still think my parents' generation is, was the worst. They got into depression, for God's sake. We don't have a depression right now. Although, we might be on the brink of one. You never know. Children of millennia are oftentimes very me centered and addicted to their devices wanting instant gratification I'm telling you we, Herbert Hoover got us in the depression a Republican and FDR got us out of the depression we've only had recessions it's those clowns that got us in the depression Herbert Hoover 
has to be the worst president of the United States, even o over Andrew Johnson, who is one vote away from being impeached. Now we need to impeach Theresa May. Nobody likes President Theresa May. She sucks. Allie Cincy, I, I, I'd know all about that. The majority of the people in my school are just stuck in their phones. Sad, constantly sad, really. Are you in high school? Yes, indeed. Those silent generations in their knickerbockers and jitterbugs. After the Depression, World War II is when the economy did really great. And everyone had a ton of kids. And those kids broke everything. Ah. So I, I really blame. I really, I really, we shouldn't have ever been in a depression. Herbert Hoover got us in it. And we haven't had a depression since FDR got rid of the depression. Thank God for FDR, a Democrat. I would have voted for him had I lived then. My, my mother voted, she was a Democrat and voted for him. Ann Truman, who dropped the, the bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki, which was warranted. My wife, a Democrat, said Truman made a mistake in doing that. So if she, if he actually made a mistake and didn't drop them, we'd be speaking Japanese right now. Without the depression, there would have never been a baby boom. Oh, my God. We didn't need the depression. Her, uh, FDR got us out of the depression, a Democrat, a great Democrat. I found myself reading a Generation Z slang dictionary that is viral yesterday and was like, what the F? are these kids talking about? I feel old. Talking about feeling old. I feel old as a baby baby boomer. I'm telling you, I blame my mother's and father's generation, whatever generation that was. I don't know what it was. I blame them for all the crap that's gone on. <coughs> Although the atomic bombs were great, loss of life it was imperative in the ending of the pacific war exactly world war two, world war two started the baby boom <coughs> <coughs> well that's my, my mother's and father's generation not the baby boom it's their fault for making the baby boom and i'm ba i'm a product of baby boomer and proud of it. Most boomers' parents are silent generation. Ah, oh, okay. That's what they call... Uh... So my, my mother and father were in the silent generation. So that came before baby boomers. So I do. I blame the silent... Silent generation. I blame them for the problems we had. I remember junior high school PE teacher said, you guys are the future. One of you guys could be president of the United States. President Theresa May is definitely a Republican. You're a year younger than my mom would be the boomers. Okay. But Silent Generation is my parents, man. They screwed the things up. Seriously. They had a depression. Have baby boomers caused a depression in this century? No. They never will. We've had recessions under the baby boomers, but not a depression. Like Silent Generation. So I blame Silent Generation for all the mistakes America's made. And yes, we did need the uh, two bombs. My wife says we didn't need those Truman bombs. And yet Truman was a Democrat, and she's a Democrat. Boomers did buy a lot of property and are profiting off of it now, while Millennials and Z are less likely to own a house. Yes, indeed. Theresa May is a bad Prime Minister, but I have to admit that no one is helping her with helping passing Brexit. Like I said, you guys in the 
in England need to get out of the European Union so you can have your own independence? Your first and only independence will be when you get out of the European Union. And she delayed it till uh, November now. So Theresa May is, is a GOPer, and she's terrible. They need to impeach President Theresa May. Theresa May is a bad prime minister, but I have to admit that no one... I agree. Wolfman. Hello, this Wolfman Jack. Yep. Theresa May is terrible. She's I think she's the worst prime minister the worst president England's ever had. I swear. Four minutes I got is all I got left. Four minutes. I've gone gone over the two hour mark. Four minutes is all I have left, guys. West Haven, what say you? And all this. I think she's a... I think West Haven's a baby boomer. Tony Blair, Gordon Brown, and David Cameron were pretty awful. Yes, I agree. Tony Blair, though, was a Democrat. Gordon Brown, I don't know much about. And David Cameron was definitely a, a bad president, too. Uh-oh. Ali Sensi's laughing at me. Oh, no. Who knew? Allie Sensi likes Tony Blair. Tony Blair was a Democrat. Labor Party, right? They're Democrats. Nothing wrong with that. But Theresa May's a frickin' GOPer, man. She's a Republican. Through and through. Tony Blair was weapons of mass destruction. Man along with Bush. Oh, there you go, see? Oh, Bush, Bush was a Republican and a conservative. I don't know how those two got along very well on the Labor Party issue. I've got three minutes left, then I gotta go. Then we can't talk about England anymore, darn it. I'm silent. I wanna be I wanna be in England. We're friends with England for God's sake. Theresa May must be impeached. You gotta yell from your lung tops and say President Theresa May needs to be impeached. There you go. I think Theresa May is the worst. You're, you're, the best president England's ever had was Winston Churchill. That guy was awesome. He fought the Germans in World War II. Sir Winston Churchill and Sir Paul McCartney. He got knighted. He deserved to be the president of England. Paul McCartney. I would yell it from the lot. Make Paul McCartney the president of England. I would vote for that, man. Give me a write-in ballot from England, guys. We'd probably go to prison for doing that, knowing this country. Yes, you would. You'd be going to Scotland Yard. We have no freedom of speech apart from if you're politically correct. You don't have the First Amendment to the Constitution like in England like we do here which is awesome, which gives me the right to photograph. I could photograph Buckingham Palace and I wouldn't get thrown in, Buck in uh, Scotland Yard. Scotland Yard needs to take back, uh, Scotland needs to take back Scotland Yard so you could have a new, your own independence prison. That's what you guys need. Get out of the European Union, England! Get out of it fast! You will regret it if you stay in it. So you, you won't be part of Europe anymore if you get out of the European Union. You'll just be England. Independent England! Make Independence Day for England! Get out of the European Union! <laughs> Theresa May sucks! <laughs> Have you heard about the drunk man that snook into the queen's bedroom one night this happened years ago oh that would be awesome first amendment audit buckingham palace and you get arrested oh no it's four o'clock i gotta go with that note on that note i'm out of here guys thanks for coming i love you all you all are awesome